So, you've hurt your low back, you think you have a disc herniation, do you need an MRI? My name is Dr. Grant Elliott, here with Rehab Fix, to tell you why you probably do not need an MRI to figure out if you have a disc herniation. You probably don't, here's why. Because, individuals without any low back pain, age 20 and up, 30% of them have a disc herniation on MRI. Pain. Age For those 20, 30% 30 of them and up, 40% of them have a disc herniation on MRI. Remember, these are people without pain. Of those 40 and up, without any pain, 50% of them have a disc herniation on MRI. 50% aged 40 and up, right? So, there's a 50% chance, or you know, 40 or 30% chance, depending on your age, that no matter what, no matter how much pain you do or don't have, they're probably gonna see a disc herniation on an MRI. That is why most of the time, MRIs, CTs, X-rays, things like that for low back related issues, done prematurely, can cause these situations to become more confusing more costly, they can lead to uh, opioid usage, injections, situations, unnecessary using. surgeries most commonly. You don't wanna let the imaging get in the way, yes, get in the way, of the path that you should be on. You always wanna pursue conservative care first, and you don't need an image to see what's in there. It's not necessary, a thorough assessment would tell me what you need, would tell me what's gonna make you better, would tell me what's wrong with your body, and most likely an image um, would either tell me things that I didn't already know, or would show a lot of things that are unnecessary. And that's why people, when they get their MRI report, sometimes they're fed a lot of information about degeneration, this bulge, this bulge, and, and all this, and it can scare you, it, it, can, it can freak you out. And that's why so many people are told these scary messages and instantly pushed off towards injections or surgery. And I don't want that to be you. I don't want you to be spending that kind of unnecessary money going towards those unnecessary procedures and I want you to understand why you probably do not need an MRI to show you a disc herniation or whatever else is going on with your low back. You just need a proper assessment, you need a proper plan so that you can fix your low back.